hello and welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be an unboxing of the crafty burrito subscription so if you like the sound of that do keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe and i'll get straight into the video now so i have done two other unboxings on my channel of this box i've done the disney goth one and also the like beetlejuice sandworms theme so i will link those two throughout this video and also in the description if you want to go and have a look at the other boxes that she's done but this one is themed team villain which is very very exciting it's kind of like disney villain themed i have explained like all the other tiers in my first video that i did so i will link that one in the eye for you if you are interested and want to kind of know more about the tiers but this subscription is over on patreon and there's a bunch of different tiers for like international and uk customers but i do get the top tier which is called you got this i could be wrong but i'll put it on the screen if i am wrong um but this one costs 28 pounds 50 a month in the uk but with vat and everything it comes to around 34 pounds 20 i believe when i actually like get billed for it so i do get billed on the first of every month for this box um, but as I said, if you don't want to spend that much, you can get one of the lower tiers. And I think they start from about £6 per month. So definitely a good range there. So as I said, this box is themed Team Villain. I did get it through the post yesterday. Um, if you can hear like a faint humming noise it is my fan i forgot to mention that at the beginning because it's quite hot <laughs> so probably all of my videos from now on will have that kind of noise in the background because otherwise i would sweat to death <laughs> so that's what that is if you can hear it but i have opened this box because i needed to take the thumbnail quickly but this is what it looks like but i haven't really had a look at anything i did see a spoiler unfortunately on instagram so i kind of have an idea of what's in this box i do know there's a clothing item a hat and obviously an art print which is on the top so i'm just going to get on with the unboxing so this says thank you for subscribing and for continuing to support my small business M M is the lady who runs the crafty burrito and this is i'm guessing kind of just like a thank you leaflet but again it's a really nice print and it says i want to be evil <laughs> So it's kind of this like brick design with these neon lights so despite it being a leaflet like you could really easily put this up as an art print so there is this on top and then i could see the hat a stripy bag and also a piece of clothing i said in my last unboxing that i knew that they were going to put a hat in this one and i'm not really a hat person it really suit me too well and also because i have a fringe like any hat is just going to push my fringe down and just create sweat and all of that but she really kindly messaged me because i think she watched that video um and she said that she was going to put in a beret for me um so she was really really sweet and she kind of wanted the best item for me so her customer service is definitely like up there and also on patreon she gave like regular updates of like when the box is shipped she gives like a free phone wallpaper a discount like she definitely is like on it <laughs> with the subscriptions so this is the beret that i see and it says team villain which has been kind of embroidered into the front of it it does actually feel like a really nice cozy material um she did say that this kind of hat because i believe it was between this like one of those bubble hats um and a baseball hat um and she said this is kind of the best one for styling with fringes so i will have to give it a go obviously like i'm not really a hat person so i will i will try it <laughs> but if not i will just pass this on to someone else who wants it it's not really that big of a deal because subscription boxes like you're not going to be able to find items that suit everyone but this is the beret and as you can see it's really like a like a fluffy wool like material i don't think it would be wool though oh it is it says 50 percent wool 50 percent acrylic it does have a boohoo label in there which is a little bit strange i'm guessing she kind of like bulk bought them and then did the embroidery on it i suppose um but there is a boohoo label in here so that's the first item it does have like the berry thing on the top of it so that is the first item and then it looks like we've got this and then also the clothing item 
The clothing item looks like a sweatshirt, so that's interesting. So I'll go through this one first. This is like a black and white striped bag with the crafty burrito sticker on it. So I'll just open this up. I think in here is going to be like the prints and like small custom item. So I did actually see these on the spoiler. So there are three mini prints, which are very cool. So this one says no power on earth can change it i feel like i really recognize this quote but i can't remember where it's from so maybe if you recognize this do let me know where this is from in the comments because i really recognize it and i can picture the person saying it but i'm like who is it <laughs> um there's this one that says come on you poor unfortunate soul this is from ursula ursula i think i'm saying that right from the little mermaid so it's got like a tentacle with again this really nice background with the ornate details again these would make a really nice set to kind of put in a frame all together because they do match and the last one says i got voodoo i got hoodoo i got things i ain't even tried again <laughs> do let me know i feel like i mean i have seen like the disney villain themes um but do let me know where this is from because i really can't think it's got like a egyptian eye on it with kind of like a tarot card so do let me know where these two are from these are the set of three prints again they're on like a really nice thick textured card so they're not like too flimsy or anything and as i said you could really easily put these in like one of those three photo frames i feel like that would be really cool so these are the prints and then i think there's a few items in here so there are these so it looks like there is a pocket mirror there <laughs> and this says you have your looks your pretty face and then it's kind of got like a swirly tentacle and again this is from the little mermaid and then there are two oh no this is what's this it's like a reward card but there is also a sticker so this says team villain on it and this is like one of her glossy vinyl stickers so from this i can recognize that that's jafar that's like snow white that's ursula from the little mermaid but i don't recognize these two <laughs> maybe i'm being silly i don't know i feel like we're we're missing maleficent would that be that one don't know <laughs> you will have to let me know so there is this glossy sticker and then the last thing in here is like this kind of pretty like almost business card looking thing and i thought this was a sticker at first but when i turned it around it says team villain evil doings reward card free death brew with every 10th deed and these look like they've been stamped this is what that looks like honestly i'm not too sure what this is when i first saw it on because i saw like the back of this on the spoiler i thought it was like a rewards card for the crafty burrito but i could be completely wrong because it doesn't say that it's more like villain themed um so i'm not too sure what this is <laughs> if emma's watching maybe she can let me know because i'm not i'm not really sure um it does look kind of cool but i'm not sure if it has like a purpose or whether it's kind of like a decorative thing and then the last item is a sweatshirt from the looks of it and this looks really really cool this is definitely something that i would wear because we got a piece of clothing in the first box but the design i'm not too sure how much use i will get out of it but this looks really really cool so it is a black sweatshirt and i did get mine in a size small and i believe yeah that's the size that i got um this looks like it should fit me it might be a little bit big but honestly like probably in the autumn winter i'm gonna want something that's oversized anyway so it does have on the corner here it has that same design that was on the sticker so it looks like this and then this one actually has a back print and it says team villain on the back of it the only thing i would say is there is a little bit of print missing from the n i think you can see that kind of like the top bit but that's not too big of an issue but it is something to notice um, and a little bit missing off the other part of it there 
It says you can wash it. Like, I think the print is one of those transfer prints, so hopefully it should be okay. But yeah, so this is the sweatshirt. I actually really, really like this item, and this is definitely made kind of the value of the box. The only thing I would say is we are going into summer now, so this is definitely something I'm going to have to kind of put away and then get out in the winter, I guess, um, because, yeah, we're in June. So kind of more going into summer, so I won't really get use out of this for a little while just because otherwise i would melt <laughs> i do actually really like this as i said this definitely made the box for me so just to recap we did get the sweatshirt which you would easily pay at least like 20 25 pounds for something like this again i like that item but i can't really get use out of it at the moment we also got the beret which again i'm not too sure how much use i'll get out of it i will try it it's also like quite like a wool material so again it's more of like a winter item um i suppose and i'm not too sure about the boohoo label although i guess it's maybe better to be up front about where it's from but who know <laughs> so there is this one there is the glossy sticker and also this which i'll have to find out more information on to find out what it's for there is this large pocket mirror and then there is the leaflet and then the last things are the prints which were these so just like with the other boxes i do feel like this box is always worth the value because you always get that like big thing that would cost probably the same amount as the box so in the first box we got that long sleeve top in the second box there was beach towel um, and a tote bag and then in this box we got that big sweatshirt and a hat so they're definitely like large items which i feel like make up the value and also her art prints alone can be pricey when you buy quite a few of them so i definitely think the value is there and as i said in my last two videos as well i really like that everything is custom made despite the beret being originally from boohoo like it hasn't been bought from boohoo with this design on this has been embroidered into it by m from the crafty burrito i did enjoy that box um as i said i'm not sure how much use i will get out of the items at this time just because we are going into summer um so hopefully maybe the next box will have a t-shirt in that would be cool as i said in my last video i'm really looking forward to the haunted mansion theme because the haunted mansion is my favorite i don't know if you noticed but this is like a print from lauren illustration she's an artist in america but that is actually the tightrope girl from the haunted mansion so i'm really looking forward to that theme and i think that's the not the next theme but the theme after because i think the next theme is like a alt world i think that's the theme i'll put it on the screen again if i'm wrong so only two more themes to go until we get to the haunted mansion theme which is the one i'm really really excited for you'll have to let me know what you think of this box and also do let me know where those like quotes on the prints are from uh, i could be missing it completely <laughs> but do let me know do give this video a like if you did enjoy it and remember to press the notification bell so you can be notified when i upload as i said don't forget to comment what you thought of the box what the quotes were and also what was your favorite item in this box and whether you think it's worth the value also don't forget to subscribe if you liked this video and want to see more on your feed and hopefully i will see you in my next video bye